Hi guys, this is a quick tutorial for a triple cut that I came up with and because I came up with it and think I'm the only one doing it I'm going to call it the edsumner.com triple cut just to advertise my website. Uh, this is how it looks. It's not the most complicated of cuts but it's quite simple to learn uh, and I do think it is pretty so it's worth learning. I'll do it a few more times for you at full speed. and then I'll talk you through it as well. Now, you start by giving the cards a Z cut, so cutting them into this Z position, three packets, and the upper right corner of the middle packet is resting now on the second finger, not the first finger, which is quite common. So it's on the second finger, and you can kind of pivot these out so that the left hand can lift its packet up in, almost like a Charlier cut on top of both of these. Now, when you get to this position, the right first finger is going to extend around the edge of that corner and it's going to square the cards between the first finger and the thumb of the right hand at the same time floating this packet against the heel of the left hand and that's quite a nice bit of the, uh, the cut. This then gets replaced back and the right hand is free to flip what was the original top packet over and then down onto the deck. The next bit's actually my favourite bit where the bottom packet pivots out, is gripped by the first finger and second finger of the left hand, flips, and then flips again. It doesn't look so good when you do it that slow, but I'll do it completely for, I'll do the whole cut complete, but not at full speed. So it's the Z cut, square and float, flip, pivot and flip and I'll do it again once more at full speed there's one variation on this as well if you want to make it a false cut that's possible as well uh, so we take the we'll do one without my name on the four spades is on top and the queen of diamonds is on the bottom you do the same cut up to this point here when you flip the original top packet. Instead of lining it up with the packet that is in jogged, you line it up with the packet that is out jogged. And then you pivot both of these out, flip, and flip. And now the four spades is on top, queen of diamonds is underneath as it was before. Uh, so the order is not changed. Uh, like I said, this is called the edsumner.com triple cut. So please check out my website, edsumner.com. And you can also find me on Facebook, facebook.com slash edsumnermagic. There you'll be able to see some other videos. And also you'll be able to see my beautiful face. Because I realise you've just been looking at my hands in the pack of playing cards. So I hope to see some of you there. And I hope to uh, read some of your comments. Thank you very much.